Nice to get a win tonight. I uh, wasn't very pleased the way we uh, guarded in the first half. Um, I told our players when the score was 13-4 to that I didn't feel like our energy level was high enough and that we were guarding well enough. And sure enough, we, uh, we let them back in the game and uh, had a really good game for the first half because uh, uh, we just didn't have it in us to put them away when we had a chance when the score was 13-4. to So uh, learn lessons without losing, uh, that when you get uh, on top of somebody, you got to continue to play hard and compete or people will come back against you. so far this season, how it stacks up? Uh, you know, we're looking for uh, a consistent third score and a fourth score. We really like to get to the point where we have four people in double figures. We think we were difficult to beat if we can have four people in double figures. And uh, um, Kaylee and Brittany have shown some consistency tonight. Carly Wheeler stepped up and played well. But uh, I'd like to see some more scoring out of some of our other people. Uh, you know, not necessarily uh, – double figures, but we need to have more people in the 7, 8, 9 category than we had tonight. You know, I think it played out that way, and uh, she earned that right by running the floor and, and getting offensive boards. Uh, most of what she did was based on her effort. She got out ahead. Uh, Rod gave her some nice passes, and then she really did a nice job on the offensive boards. And what she scored, like our first 10 points, something like that, and, and uh, got off to a real good start. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to find out. I mean, she's she's very talented and uh, very smooth, and sometimes uh, makes the game look too easy. And and uh, uh, I'm just glad she's on our team. The only regret I have is she's a senior, and four years have gone pretty quick here, but she's been a good leader for us and uh, is, is getting where she's a good practice player this year. She kind of got away from that her sophomore and junior years, and she's accepted the, and embraced the role of being a leader on this team. And, uh, you know, I just hope she finishes her career out the way she's playing right now because uh, she's a special player. Um, hoping to celebrate the Native American Heritage Month by Angela and I. Absolutely. We were very proud to play in this game, and, and uh, uh, we have a large Native American population within our state, and we're very proud of that. And, and to, to celebrate that and, and wear the turquoise colors and, and uh, uh, just playing this game was special for our players. expect them to uh, react to a change in atmosphere? Well, we're going to have to, some of them, it's the first time they go on the road, and there's different dynamics involved in that, and, and uh, we're definitely going to have to play better, and especially better on the defensive end than we did tonight, and can't foul as much as we did tonight. Uh, Missouri State's a team that's coming off of a 13-point win at Mississippi, which is a very impressive win. Uh, they played well the last half of the season last year. They've got a lot of momentum. Uh, they got some type of ceremony where they are recognizing Jackie Styles, the all-time NCAA leading scorer, and uh, I expect there'll be a lot of people there. Um, so could you guys just talk about the offensive output that y'all been experiencing this, this start to the season? So does that mean like our our offense? <laughs> Okay. Um, I think that we have a team that can really, like, everyone can score. So I think that our offense kind of isn't, like, relying on just me to score or just Kaylee to score. So we have – I think it's cool because we have a lot of people that can score. So we don't need to worry about one person's game being off. We can we can really count on each other. So I think that's something different. Kaylee mentioned that she was 11 points pretty quick. Was that the plan or did it just kind of happen that way? Um, well, their posts were smaller than us, so we kind of figured, like, we need to pound it inside and uh, get easy buckets. So um, I think that was the game plan, but she was doing moves we've never seen before. So um, I, I don't know if all that was the game plan, but she did pretty good. I told you that at this start to the season, the past five games, including the two 
including the two exhibition was the highest scoring output that this program has put together since the 08 09 season. Do you buy that, Ryan? Uh, no, I believe it. We have, like I said, that everybody can score. I think in the past we kind of rely on a few people that uh, to make baskets and things like that, and this team all can score. So I don't, I believe that. Yeah, yeah, it's all right. <laughs> I miss the orange and the white. Yeah, it was kind of weird saying, go, like, come on, blue. Yeah, like, like what are we supposed to say? Yeah. Um, Carly, you had two threes in the first half. Was that something you were looking for, or is it just you were just open until you shot? Um, I was open until I shot it. Um, I'm looking to shoot a lot this season. Um, that's kind of my, my first look. So, um, and they left me open, they backed off, so.